Howdy. So, I got up this morning in a big rush. I forgot to bring my camera out. Um, I have been to the post office to get my travel insurance and my euros from the money shop. I didn't get one of them travel cards in the end because it was too late. So, I've just been to Ops and Cycles to um, get my bike fixed. Put a new brake on it. It's working nice and sweet now. Um, and I've got some chest protectors off Old School J from, for my son, for Oscar. Um, for when I get back, when we go on a little ride. So I'm just going to pack the van back up now, go back home and finish these cupboard doors and then I'll be on my way. Okay, so it's three o'clock. I've been potting around in the back of the van all afternoon. I've got half of the cupboards on, but I've run out of time now. So I'm just gonna go to Robin's and then we're gonna go get some food shopping in, do a bit of tidying in the van, hoovering and cleaning and stuff, make sure everything's packed away and ready to go. So, off we go. Hi. So we're just doing a bit of cleaning and organising all our stuff before we set off on the road finally. Got the back all nice and organised, it's almost time to go. All packed, ready to go, just got to go and get some food shopping. Shopping done. Only got one bag of shopping, we don't need much. Do need a yo-yo. Did need a yo-yo. <laughs> right, shopping's all loaded up, got a full tank of fuel, and we're ready to go. So it's half two in the morning, we are finally here at Dover and it's time to go to bed. Thanks for watching, see you tomorrow. Good morning, we broke up nice and bright and early in Dover, it's about half eight in the morning, we've got to move at nine o'clock. But uh, we're getting just getting ready if we're having breakfast and then we're gonna go and catch our ferry. Exciting. All the spots I'm gonna be camping at over this next two weeks are free spots and it's all thanks to a website called wildcamping.co.uk. You should go and check it out, it's really good. Whew. Okay, so this morning hasn't exactly gone quite to plan. Um, the inverter that I had installed to charge my laptop and my camera battery he started getting a fault on it and making a high-pitched noise i think it might be something to do with a fuse somewhere but the particular type of fuse i haven't got so um i've had to dash to maplin and pick up a 12 volt charger for my canon and a 12 volt charger for my laptop uh, now we can finally go back to the ferry terminal and get this ferry. Let's go. Um, so we're, we're at the ferry terminal now, ready, ready to board. We're, we're pretty early, so they gave us an earlier boat. Um, we were meant to be going at like 12, but now we're going at 10 past 11 instead. So we've got like half an hour to go. So we're quickly just going to make some breakfast because I am starving. So what about you? Pretty hungry. 
Just waiting to board the ferry. We tried to make some food, but we ran out of time. So I've got half a toasted piece of bread and a normal piece of bread. And the same as Robin with avocado and spinach. We're just sitting, waiting to board now. We're going to go any second. to me that the last time that I was on a ferry going over from Dover to France was exactly 10 years ago this year in fact 10 years ago in May uh, when I was used to be sponsored by Nike um, we went over and did a road trip went road to Paris and stuff like that so that's exactly 10 years ago crazy <laughs> Remind you of anything? Goodbye England, see you in two weeks. quick toilet break and uh, so far driving through France is a piece of cake Dri driving on the wrong side of the road just doesn't feel that bad at all feel perfectly fine really and uh, on the sat nav we've chosen to avoid all the tolls uh, it's taken us two hours longer than originally planned but I don't mind because the roads are just amazing just look, how, look how nice this is Good times. So after a long, long day of driving, we are finally at our first spot to stay the night in France. Um, middle of nowhere called La, La Barrage. And it took us seven hours to get here. Um, we did start off doing the, um, doing the route with the sat nav, avoiding all tolls, but that just took so long. So in the end, we switched it to fastest, fastest route. It, so we realised that the extra time avoiding the tolls just cost us just as much in fuel so we ended up going on the tolls and ended up saving like an hour and a half in time in the end but we're here and all you can hear is nothing but the birds tweeting it is so good so now we're going to make some food have a beer and go to bed see you tomorrow <laughs> 